to admit, I do miss that Pacific Northwest weather. Sometimes. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> You've been here over a month now. What do you think of our little oasis? Everybody's very cool, and way different. Can't even believe nobody's freaking out about Daniel's power. Well, Sean, it's still hard for me to wrap my head around it. But people here are not gonna get in your space. They have their own past, too. That's why people come here, from all over the country. For their own reasons. Not perfect, but it works. It is so peaceful out here. <laughs> Guess that's what everybody's really looking for. Peace. You're probably right. Yes, I still feel like we're really privileged out here. There's bad shit going on in this desert. <laughs> yeah. I don't think you can ever really get away from everything. You can't escape reality. Even here. We just live slightly apart from it. So, how did you end up here? <laughs> this place is not on the map. Like most of us, I was first brought here by someone, Maggie. After I failed to make it in New York, I was lucky enough to meet her down in Florida. She's had a tough life. This place was her getaway. She's long gone now, but her name is still written all over this place. <sighs> well... Thanks for bringing us here. Oh, Sean. I'm glad I was able to help you. <laughs> By the way, can you grab your brother so we can all talk? Is everything okay? Uh, yeah, I just thought we could spend this day together. Just the three of us. Big brother to Superwolf. We need you at Karen's trailer. Copy? Sure. I mean, 10-4. <laughs> Hola. Hola, compadre. How about a trek around the canyon today? You in? Totally. Let's pack then. It's a bit remote for me. I mean, we're just so far away from civilization. Hmm. Civilization is only what you make it, right? That's why people come here from all over the country for their own reasons. This place is like another world. I don't even know how to describe it. <laughs> I think you just did. It has a unique atmosphere. <sighs> That's why people come here from all over the country for their own reasons. Not perfect, but it works. Hope it's worth it. It's not easy to live as outcasts. Off the grid? Clearly not. We ought to be almost self-sufficient, and it's a very lonely life. It's cool you found your safe space. I guess. You can't escape reality. Even here. We just live slightly apart from it. I couldn't live here for too long. It feels... disconnected. Maybe I'm too young. <laughs> oh, I understand. It's not a starting point. It's more a place to sit back and let go. <laughs> <laughs> 